going on guys? We are three days out of Power Cruise this weekend. This is Power Cruise 77, I think it is. Now, I haven't been, I didn't go last year, but the year before I did take my HQ, so I'm going back with the patrol this time. Hopefully it's quick enough, but three days out and there's a bit to do. What I need to do is, well, right now I'm doing an oil change. Oil change, clean the filter, oil filter, new uh, radiator fluids going in, all that stuff. Make sure it gets a good check over because it's going to get a hard workout. I'm actually going up a grade in oil as well. Uh, you normally use a 10W40, but I've gone a 10W50 because the temperatures around the track are going to be a lot higher than what it would on the street. So it just gives it a bit more protection there when the temps get up and also I may be doing the burnout competition, which is gonna be hard on it. Mm. Speaking of burnouts, I also need to pop down and grab some new tires. I gotta run probably 16, 15 or 16s, maybe some highlights rooms or something on there just to get some smaller tread on the back. So, because I know for a fact, those burnout pads are goddamn sticky. So, these fat tires are gonna be no good doing the burnout. I'm also going to, well, actually, racing around the track. I'm not gonna have the canopy on because the thing's just gonna roll over. So, <laughs> I'm actually gotta get this sorted out, but, the legs that I was getting, I was gonna make out of, it was just a trailer jack, and where I was getting them from, they're on back order, I'm not gonna get them in time, so now I'm gonna to have to pop around the old bands and maybe use this hoist just to lift this thing off, get to the show, then on Saturday, I'm shooting down to Super Cheap in Midland for the car show there. There's a, they've got an open day, and I need to put the canopy back on for that, so I'll be going back on, and then that night, Got to take it off after the show and head back to Power Cruise for the burnout comp on Saturday night and then Sunday on the track again. So, Power Cruise 2018, let's hit it. So bloody racket out there, but what's happening is the off street, actually, the drifting is happening at the moment, and then there's off street drag racing, which we're gonna go into. So we're hitting all the events at the moment, and then it's burnouts tonight. So we're out on the track at the moment. These events, you have to wear sort of long sleeves, helmets, all that kind of stuff. So it's not like the normal cruise session where you can take your mates. This is where the real action happens. All right, I just rocked up with Power Cruise, and I've been here for maybe five. Oh God. Got so we've got old mate talking in the background, but we I just got here and this happened to my exhaust. Two laps around the track and uh, it blew the actual um, so gasket out of the days. exhaust, so it started to so sound like a tractor. One, Shut up! So I'm under here. She blew, she blew. Ah. I'm up against like the most powerful looking Falcon, holy sugar. Wheel speed in first, I think I'm going to try take off in second now. And that'll keep the wheel spin down at the start and give me one less gear change because the gear change is what killed me actually. Alright, race number two in second gear. He's uh, the number one passenger for this next cruise. Oh, those guys get to go straight out. All right, he's gonna be sort of the cameraman for this first one. Get some shots here and there. Let's get to it.
Now, I was shocked to see there was actually one other 4B out on the track on the day. It was a Land Cruiser with whatever motors Land Cruisers have, but it was pretty quick anyway. <laughs> also convinced the missus to come out on the track as well and uh, safe to say she thoroughly fucking shit herself! wasn't the fastest car around the track on the day, people thoroughly enjoyed the pyrotechnic show it put on. <laughs> that petrol life. Alright, so recap from last night, uh, I didn't film sort of the aftermath, but two blower belts snapped, so the first one taken off in second, got a bit of smoke going, thought I'd try and hit third to get some more smoke going, and uh, the box just wouldn't let me sort of flow through the gear, so I was like, I don't know, got impatient, put it in third and just tried to stab it, and it snapped the belt straight away, so had a spare one, and they kindly let me back onto the pad so the second time round stayed in second just went out and um, probably 10 seconds in after I did sort of my first loop I felt I lost power steering I was like oh what's going on there and then it started to get a bit hot like over 100 degrees I'm like oh, okay it's probably all right and then um, sort of noticed that there was no blower wine anymore so I was like oh belt's gone again but um, obviously it just kept sucking through um, pretty much naturally aspirated burn out there so yeah, I kept going for a little bit, but um, yeah, ended up pulling off sort of when it got a bit too hot over about 1.30. So, you know, you got to look after the thing. <laughs> so, yeah, a little bit of a skid there. Like, I was happy I did something. So, yeah, spewing. So now I'm sitting at Power Cruise again on the Sunday, waiting for all these shops to open and hopefully find somewhere that's got the right belt to fit because, um, yeah, I want to get back out there. So, let's see what happens. And I did in fact get out there again guys, on the Sunday I had an awesome day, managed to find a belt from the local store, um, the driving on Sunday was pretty much the same sort of stuff that was happening the previous day so I didn't do much filming, but what I was able to do is meet a couple of followers who were out there on the day as well, get them in the passenger seat and take them for a rip around the track which was awesome to do as well. Um, now I'm back home, I actually forgot to record an outro cruising home because it was all getting hectic towards the end and I needed to pack up and, and get back and sort things out. But filming an outro for you now guys, make sure you do subscribe if you enjoy 
and hit on my Patreon page. I'm gonna start posting a lot more content on that now. I wanna try and reshape that page a bit and give you a lot more behind the scenes and extra videos for you guys to check out there. So please take a look in the link below. Merchandise will be there as well on my website. There's some new stuff coming out for this summer, which is awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take it easy, peace. <laughs> Oh hey, click the button to subscribe to my channel and you'll finally be happy.